Hi, this is Bishop Brian, and it is good to be with you uh, through video uh, and be able to say hello to uh, St. Nicholas School, to students and to faculty and staff and to the community that make up uh, the great uh, group of folk that uh, are connected to St. Nicholas. My name is Bishop Brian, and I serve as the Bishop of the Diocese of East Tennessee. I'm speaking to you from my home in Knoxville, Tennessee, and I wanted to say hello and wanted just to have a few minutes to reflect with you on the idea of where you and I are finding heroes and heroines right now. Uh, in a time of COVID-19 season, we're being encouraged to wear masks when we go outside to keep uh, keep people safe, uh, to keep ourselves safe and to keep others safe as we get close, uh, in close proximity to folk, to keep distance and to know that we also, it's smart to wear a mask. So here's the mask that I got. It's, it's the fabric, it's the images of Marvel Comics. It's Spider-Man and Thor and Iron Man. And I got that. When I saw that, I thought, that's the fabric that I want to wear on my face to keep me safe and to keep others safe uh, that I get close to. And the reason I chose that fabric, when I was a child, when I was your age, I loved comic books. And I grew up in a small town in Missouri. And I think, I think it was Wednesdays. I think the comic books came on Wednesdays. And my mom would give me her loose change, and I would run down the street, and I would go to the drugstore, the Trainer Clevenger Drugstore, and I would get a comic book. I would buy comic books about Spider-Man, and about Batman, and about Wonder Woman, and about Superman. And I loved, I devoured those comic books. I read them over and over and over again. And I love to read stories about people uh, being heroic, people being brave, people being strong, people being good, as they were combating evil and protecting uh, the innocent and protecting the weak, and protecting boys and girls. And we are living in this time when we're trying to stay safe from the virus and to keep our families safe. And so it's a time to remember that the heroes and heroines in our world right now are not Spider-Man and Iron Man and Thor and Wonder Woman and Batman and Superman. They are people that you know. They are your doctor. Are they the nurse at your school? Are they your teachers? They're your folks who work at the grocery store who keep the shelves stocked so that moms and dads and grandparents and the people that love you uh, have easy and good access to food. They are people who show up every day and do their work. And so they're people that you know. And so we don't have to buy a comic book in order to find out about heroes and heroines. It's always good to read good stories, and it's always good to read good books. And if you'll notice behind me, I have a few books in my library. And I'm not going to show you, but I also have piles of books on the floor. I don't always keep the uh, neatest room. And so if you have trouble not always keeping a neat room, the bishop understands what's going on there. Uh, it's, it's true for me as well. But I wanted you to know that some of the most important people that serve us uh, are the people you see every day. Uh, the parents that love you and grandparents that love you, uh, nurses and doctors and teachers, uh, clergy people, everyday folks who show up and do their work and do their work uh, in this time of COVID-19. Uh, know that uh, the people that love you are doing all they can to keep you safe. Uh, that's why we're now going to school at home. And uh, there will be a time when this will be over. And I will be back with you in person at St. Nicholas. And I look forward to that time to be in chapel with you at that time. Until then, uh, you're in my prayers. I'm grateful for you. And I'm grateful that you're part of the St. Nicholas School. Bye-bye.